Hey, what's up guys and welcome back to Ask NK. Today we're looking at an add-on update. This is City Builder 3D, which is made available by the guys at Light Architect, the same creators of Chaos Add-on, and we've talked about the City Builder previously, but today we're seeing an update that deals with these assets add-on. Now, if you scroll all the way down, you would notice that we now have a brand new 15 Soviet assets. Now, these assets are awesome and we've already talked about the fact that they also have the Metropolitan, the Derelict, and now we are seeing this one. So if you're one of those artists that love working with highly detailed 3D models, you want to create that next Hollywood blockbuster looking kind of stuff, then of course you should take a look at this one so the beautiful thing about what they've done is in case you are not comfortable with you know buying the product the way it is right now they've sliced them into several chunks and you can get them as individual piece or you can save the money and get the full pack which consists of over 55 different assets and they are highly highly detailed and you will definitely find these ones very useful so without further ado let's go ahead and pop up blender and take a look at what these assets look like so with blender simply open so what you need to do once you download it is to go over to edit go over to preference and get that going next up if you press n on your keyboard you would notice that we have the city builder 3d right here so if we scroll all the way we have the metropolitan pack and we also have the soviet so within the soviet you can either choose to get the small one so if you click you get to notice that we have a smaller one right here there are also some pretty cool ones that you can get which has to do with the medium version so they have medium buildings that can stay behind the small ones and this is if you want to create some sort of landscape and then you can get the very very large one and it's also worth knowing that within individual packs there are five different buildings so the small buildings are five the medium buildings are five and also the large buildings are five and these cuts across all of them from the derelict future to the sci-fi and also to the metropolitan so depending on what you want to create you have five variations. so if you need the small ones there are five variations that you can play with you also have five variations for the medium and also for the large and to me i think this is a very lovely looking add-on and i love all of the time and effort that's been put into this because if we simply jump back right here you would notice that we have some pretty cool details going on here unprecedented details i tell you so these things are extremely extremely high and if you render these in cycles you would literally appreciate them for what they are right now you can see very highly detailed texture and we can actually zoom in and you can see all of this i think i did see some clothes somewhere cool so you can see stuff like this very highly detailed stuff and you can also see the same thing for both the medium and also the large buildings so you can use this in your scene and tweak your scene however you choose and if you're feeling excited about getting the whole thing you can get all of these and use them for your project something else which is also very interesting to note is right now if you would also want to get all of this pack and you don't want to just spend one after the other you want to get the whole pack you can actually get the add-on value pack. Now, the add-on value pack comprises of both the Chaos Fire Shader, the Light Architect Bundle, the Cable Cam Bundle, and also the City Builder 3D. So to me, I would suggest that this is a good pay, so you can pay for this one and get it, contrary to spending individual amounts trying to get this one after the other. I think it's a good buy to get this one, but if you don't have any use for the cable and you also don't have any use for the Chaos, then simply grab this and start working with it. And a huge shout out to the guys at Light Architect for making this one possible. And of course, if you want to get this, link is going to be in the description and you can do well to check these things out. So this is definitely going to be about it. I would like to know what you guys think about this in the comment section. And of course, if you like this video or you learned something from this, you can go ahead and give it a like and don't forget to share with a friend. And if you're new here, it's going to be amazing for you to hit the subscribe button and also turn on the notification so that you don't miss the next video or the next update. And until I see you guys again with a tutorial update, free Friday, tutorial Tuesday, tips and tricks, things like this. Peace.